Welcome to Galaxy Aerospace Ghana. Presenting on Space News today is FOMO Camila. The headline, SpaceX Starship Mega Rocket launched second ever test flight, but exploded in a rapid unscheduled disassembly. The news in detail. SpaceX Next Generation Mega Rocket, the largest ever built, was launched on its second ever test flight on November 18, a highly anticipated expedition that took the giant to space for the first time but did not last long. Shortly after stage separation, the rocket's massive super heavy booster exploded, with the Starship upper stage vehicle itself detonating before reaching its target altitude in what SpaceX called a rapid unscheduled disassembly. The massive Starship and super heavy booster took off at about 8 a.m., that is 7 a.m. local Texas time, from SpaceX Starbase test and manufacturing facility in Boca Chica. Starship stage separation occurred on time at about 2 minutes and 41 seconds after liftoff and appeared to go smoothly, but the heavy booster exploded shortly afterward. It was the second explosive moment for the biggest rocket ever built, but SpaceX hailed it as a success. The first liftoff occurred on April 20th of this year, one reason for April's unscheduled disassembly was the failure of Starship's two stages to separate because the propellants leaked from the super heavy booster and caused fires that severed the connection with the primary flight computer. To prevent a recurrence of this problem on the second flight, SpaceX decided to go with a new strategy called hot staging, in which the upper stage's engines begin firing before Starship and Super Heavy have fully separated. The spacecraft was never expected to reach full orbit around Earth. Instead, flying on a suborbital trajectory to splash down in the Pacific Ocean off the coast of Hawaii. SpaceX and the crowds of spectators at South Padre Island were not the only ones cheering on Starship that day. A lot is riding on the success of SpaceX's new rockets, including the timeline for NASA's return of astronauts to the surface of the moon. Assessments of this second test flight will show whether SpaceX's new system is effective at reducing debris and pollution. Starship's launch that day was hoped to lead to an increase in launch count for new vehicles as further refined designs make their way to the launch pad at Starbase. Moving forward, SpaceX may aim to fly Starship test missions as often as once a month, which, if maintained, will go a long way toward certifying the vehicle for crewed launches in time for Artemis 3. Elon Musk has praised the vehicle's capabilities for rapid reusability and hopes to see the same vehicles launching, landing, and relaunching multiple times a day, eventually amounting to possible hundreds of Starship launches every week. Thank you for watching, and please don't forget to subscribe to all our social media platforms.